I just want to do a quick follow-up video because I've been a little bit busy and I haven't got sidetracked on doing the autofocus test on all three cameras. So that would be the G9, the GH5S and the GH5. Um, somebody left me a message um, saying I was sponsored by Panasonic. I'm not sponsored by Panasonic. All of the stuff, all of my Panasonic, all of my cameras actually, I own. I purchased them myself with my own money. Nobody's given me anything. Um, these, re these reviews and these videos are my own thoughts of the camera because people ask me a lot of questions about my gear. We, we have coffee and cameras every Saturday in the gallery from 12 to 2 and different photographers, amateurs, professionals all come in and we all have a chat and we talk about our cameras, we talk about everything, people ask me questions. Um, I'm a professional photographer. Um, I've been working for myself for nine years now. I'm very lucky, I get to travel the world. And the Panasonic system was to be integrated into my other systems. So it's a system that I can travel with um, the G9 is a phenomenal stills camera. A good video camera, but as for stills, it's amazing. So all of the stuff that you see in my videos, I actually own. It's not loaned to me, it's not given to me for reviews, it's actually my own gear that I purchased. And it's just me giving other people their feed, giving other people my feedback on what I think the cameras can do. And I, I'm not gonna do full in technical reviews that last for 10, 20, 30 minutes, 40 minutes, talking about the specific technical side of a camera. I'm not that type of person. If it works for me and how it works for me, I will then relay that in my videos to you guys. That's about it. I'm not gonna go into technical specifications of cameras because everybody's different and everybody gets something different from their cameras. There is no perfect camera. If there was, there will, well, that'd be very boring. Anyway, back to the video. So what this video is, is just quickly, it's just a quick test that we're gonna do with the G5, GH5 and the GH5S and the G9. And the lens I'm gonna use is my 200 f2.8. And we're gonna use this for autofocus tracking. And it's gonna autofocus track my lovely assistant that works for me in the gallery, Andrea. She's gonna be using our Segway Mini Pro, which is a mini Segway, not a cheap Chinese knockoff, it, it's a, a Segway. The batteries don't blow up or anything, hopefully. Well, we ne we've had no problems with it, so that's great. Um, and so basically, she's gonna be riding that. Um, she's gonna be doing up to 10 miles an hour, which is 16 Ks an hour. Um, and we're gonna let the camera do the tracking and lock on and focus, and then see if it tracks her in the video coming towards the camera, and then also going away from the camera. That's what you guys will see. And this is just to, for a little bit of entertainment, I guess, until I get time to do a full test on all the lenses and the cameras. So if you want me to test anything else on the cameras in that review, please let me know. Um, leave me a comment below. I will try my best to include it in the video, but I am limited on time. We have a big exhibition coming up in March and that's like three weeks away. So I do need to get on top of that, but I will do my best to include it. Now, quickly, the reason why I went for the Panasonic system is their cameras are amazing. The technology that's built into these is, it just blows my mind, really. Um, you do lose the shallow depth of field that you do get with a full frame camera, but you can't have everything. You do get great autofocus focusing. You get amazing um, video from these cameras. And the G9 um, has impressed me a lot. This camera is phenomenal, to be truthful. It's, I would say, is 90 to 95% as good as my D5. And it's a much lighter. That I do lose that tracking ability that the D5 has, um, nothing can match that. That is the best sports camera on the market. But it's a lot of gear, it's a lot of weight. Especially when I travel overseas, I've got to carry that gear. And it gets harder and harder with the restrictions on planes now. So that's why I've purchased the Panasonic system. And the other reason is, is I'm a Leica nut. I am, I'm, I'm completely um, infatuated with Leica cameras. I think they're the most beautiful cameras in the world. They're built so well. It's something very special to hold something in your hand that's been hand built that weighs the same as a house brick, basically. And I am one of those other crazy people that have an M246 monochrome. Uh, I get questions about why I bought a black and white camera all the time. And I will cover that in the video one day soon. I think that's something I should actually talk about is why I was crazy enough to purchase a, um, a Leica M246. And then I have all my Leica glass. Um, this is the Sumeron. This is a 5.6 28 mil. It's a remake of the original, 
Um, very limited run of them, beautifully made, and it's an, an amazing small lens. But that again is, is a different story. The, like, the Panasonic system is because of the Leica glass. This isn't just some Leica brand name stuck onto a standard lens. This is something very special. They're all metal construction. The glass is amazing. It's pin sharp at 1.4, 1.2. The contrast and the shallow depth of field you get from these lenses is, is, is Leica. That's all I can say, it is a Leica looking lens. Um, and like I said, the quality, everything, the aperture ring on the front, something very special about having an aperture ring on the front. So I will cover something about my lenses and everything else, but just enjoy this video with Andrea on the Segway. I, I am really, I, I'm recording this before we do the Segway part, so I, I hope she doesn't crash. Nah, she won't crash, she'll be fine. Oh baby, I love your madness is so incredibly beautiful. Oh, oh, oh. you shine like gold, so selfless to all. And while I can't anymore, so I say I'm the same. Please leave me a comment um, and maybe subscribe to my channel. I will be doing more videos like this and I will try and get them out as fast as I can. And all of the gear I will be reviewing for now is something that I own. I purchased and it works for me. So I'll be giving you my genuine feedback. So thank you very much for watching the video. I hope you enjoy it and I'll see you again soon.